Oh hi, I'm Eva. I decided to dye my hair fire truck red. I'm taking the counsel of the ladies at Sally Beauty Supply, of whom told me what to buy. Literally, like I own none of this. Like even down to what brush to buy. She's like this the one. She also told me this would hold all of it, and I don't believe her now because I'm looking at all the size of the bottles. All three of these have to go in here, and I'm not sure if that's gonna fit. And if she's wrong, then this entire thing is gonna go terribly for me. I'll be honest with you. I just YouTubed all this. I have no idea if what I'm doing is right or if what those people did is right. I mean, I watched a lot of hair dressers make fun of people for doing it wrong, so I feel like I learned a few things. Oh, my hair is staticky. But I mean, for all I know, this is gonna go terribly. But then again, I once woke up with neon purple hair after drinking too much tequila, so like, this can't be that much worse, can it? Like, really? It can't get that bad. Okay, so they seem to be sectioning this way-ish. Normally I go brown or I go blonde. Like, I was blonde for most of my life. In fact, in the earliest videos you can find on my channel, I think there's like one left, I, had to, I deleted a lot of them. Um, I had white blonde hair, and I had white blonde hair for most of my life. This here is my natural color. But I've had a shitty week, as you know, like it's been two weeks of absolute hell in my house. So I was like, you know what, fuck it. Like, I want weird hair. I want exciting hair, actually. I'm wearing a ridiculously holy shirt. It's one of my dad's old work shirts. Ah, this shit does not come out. That's what it looks so, like so far. Well, as per usual, I came home and I was like, hey, roommate, guess what? And he's like, what? I'm like, I'm doing a thing again. Except last time I was like, hey, dude, I did a thing. I came home looking like a cow. This time I warned him ahead of time that I was doing something stupid. Last time was fake tanner. <laughs> Okay, this is how full it is now, and this stuff is supposed to be two to one. So this entire bottle has to go in there. You liar. Oh my god, yeah, this is fucking, oh, it's gonna spill everywhere. So the same non-metallic, this is not metallic, hopefully this works. This takes an incredible amount of mixing. Looks like strawberry cheesecake though. Oh, and it dripped on my face already. This is way, way harder than I thought it would be. But they seem very adamant that you use a brush to do this. But I don't know how much to put. YouTube didn't teach me this part. They just kind of paint it and it seems to be a thing that they do. But it also said not to go right to your root because your root saturates faster or something. It lifts faster because the heat. Oh my god, it's all over my fucking face. I'm sorry lady at Sally Beauty, but I got no patience for this. None at all. I'm a fan of the fuck it technique. If you're going, Eva, that's not how I do it on YouTube, I know. I just have no fucking patience for the way they do it on YouTube. Like, I can understand a professional using the brush technique and, like, foiling and layering, because, like, you have both hands and, like, you can see everything, but, I mean, I don't. Ooh, I shouldn't have let that touch my neck. You're seeing that look of strain? That's called the smell so bad my eyes hurt. My neck is on fire. I'm starting to think that the brush is that you don't like get it all over your scalp, but I've already done that. I feel like I'm gonna suffer the consequences because my scalp is already on fucking fire. I need a hairdresser in my life. I need uh, like a go-to hairdresser. If there's a hairdresser in Edmonton who's willing to take me on as a client, who will like put up with the weird shit I do to my hair, like that'd be great. I pray to God I get all the stains off my face because I've given up on trying to reduce them. I feel like if I just keep piling in more color, like something good will happen, you know? Side note, I definitely got all this shit in my nice white sink. I have made a huge mess of my bathroom. Ow! Looks a little bit like I'm trying to cover up a murder right now. Oh my god, my ear. You know what, ear? Screw it, you're, you're lost. How's the back of my neck look? I can't see it, but I feel like it's bad. I mean, if nothing else, you know, I should do this around Halloween and then I'll just look really fucking festive. Whoever gave me my adult certificate was being fucking negligent though, because this doesn't feel very adulty. I like to point out I did my taxes today and I was like, yeah, I feel like such a good adult. You know, when got groceries and like did normal running around that adults do and then I was like, fuck it, I wanna dye my hair red. <laughs> Um, I didn't condition my hair because the internet told me not to, so it feels terrible right now. Once it's fully saturated or whatever, I'm gonna condition it again. But depending on the light, it looks either like almost black or very, very red. So much for having to use a fucking brush, you can just screw with it and like mush it into your hair and you'll be fine. You'll be just, you'll be fine. I'm down with it. I'm gonna rock it for a while, we'll see how it goes. <laughs> Anyways, if you guys like this video, please hit like, comment down below, tell me if you like the red or not, and uh, hit subscribe so I can see you guys next time.